Top stories worldwide, this week at FCA. Agreement reached. Julia and Jeeps. Helping minority suppliers. All right now on FCA Replay. We can announce today that the UAW FCA has reached a tentative agreement. I want to first... Uh... FCA US and the UAW reached a tentative deal on a new collective bargaining agreement this week. The agreement, if ratified, will cover about 40,000 UAW-represented workers at FCA US. CEO Sergio Marchioni and UAW President Dennis Williams jointly announced that a tentative agreement was reached. The question is, did you, do you respect UAW today more than you did before you started? And usually, usually the answer is no, and in this particular case the answer is yes. And what I love about our organization, most of all, no matter what we do, what action we take, the ultimate decision in the power of the union is our members, and they will make the final decision. The world's automakers gathered in Germany this week for the Frankfurt Motor Show. The highlight for the Alfa Romeo brand was the auto show debut of the all-new Julia sedan, shown in high-performance quadrifolio trim with a twin-turbo V6. Sales of the new Julia are set to begin next year. Mopar and Jeep paired up to present three concepts at Frankfurt. The Jeep Cherokee Crawler, Wrangler Rubicon Sunriser, and Renegade Trailhawk each showcased Mopar's customization possibilities. Speaking of Jeep, workers at the FCA US headquarters were treated to a lunchtime show by the popular alt-rock band X Ambassadors. The band's hit song, Renegades, has helped power the launch of the subcompact Jeep Renegade. Helping the Tier 1 supplier community find minority and women-owned companies to work with is the goal of FCA's annual matchmaker event. More than 3,100 people, with representatives from more than 270 companies, converged on FCA US headquarters to network and look for ways to work together. Now in its 16th year, the matchmaker event has generated more than $2.3 billion in new business opportunities. And that's a quick look at some of this week's top stories on FCA Replay. I'm Dale Jewett for FCA Digital Media.